Welcome back, guys. We're here with our monthly book of $1 tickets. We have for June the Be Lucky ticket. This is the new Pennsylvania ticket. This one we need the B symbol. Uh, looks like a little B or the Hive symbol. The B is an automatic win. The Hive is a $5 win. Odds on these are 1 in 4.54. We have 100 tickets. We're hoping to get through these in 18 minutes. Oh, that's the first time I've seen the bone. All right, this coin is not scratching well with these. All right, let's keep going. It's probably this scratch pad kind of sinks in on some of the coin or the tickets. All right, hopefully everyone's doing well. I definitely thank everyone for coming through today uh, as we run through this book. This will be a relatively quick session because I actually know where the symbols are, so that usually helps. And unlike past uh, $1 books, I can finally say I have accomplished my goal of finding a claimer, finally. Um, if you guys missed that, I'll try and make sure I put a, uh, a shortcut at the top of the screen for you guys to check it out. It was definitely a lot of fun. It was in a group book, but uh, I did make sure I put some... Um... Oh, we got a B. It took us about six tickets to find one. And we get the free ticket. Let me get the pen out. All right, so, yep. Happened in a group book on the Monopoly 50X ticket of all tickets, believe it or not. So, definitely uh, check that out, guys. Anyone watching right now has had any luck on that uh, Hunt for Cash ticket? That ticket seems to be like the... Uh, Redhead stepchild of Pennsylvania right now. No one seems to want to play that ticket. Um, and I have talked myself, we got a B, I have talked myself out of doing a book, even a dirty book, probably about 11 times now. But I don't know, I'm still tempted to try it. I mean, I'm, I'm okay with doing a whole book. I mean, if I can get, you know, 160 back. You know, 160 to 175 back. I mean, that's the typical return on a five dollar book, except that 500 cash money. Um, yeah, um, pretty much most of the books I've ever done give me that much back. So far with this one, this has been a slow ticket. Well, 15 tickets, we only won a two dollars <laughs> so far. So this is uh, playing kind of interesting here. There's nothing else in the middle there. Yeah. I've been just doing the main play areas. Got cats, dogs, little chickens, bones. I didn't see a bone on the first couple tickets that I did of this. Wow. Well, if this isn't freaking people out from buying this ticket, I don't know what it is. We are 20 tickets in and we only won $2. Like... It's not even sticking with the uh, odds on the ticket. <laughs> so, maybe, I don't know. I, I'm not going to sit here and say, well, maybe that means we'll get a big win somewhere. We got a B symbol. Another free ticket. Wow, $21 worth of tickets, and we won $3. I kind of keep these all facing the same way. Little one is a little chicken in there. So, for anybody that was uh, remote a lot during the pandemic, have you returned to the office or did your office do what some places are kind of doing and let you stay remote? We got a B symbol. Oh, look, our first $2 win. All right, we're up to five bucks. Yay! Five dollars and twenty-five dollars in tickets. Jeez. Yeah, we pretty much uh, started going back full time in my office like last year. So, you got to be simple. Um, you got two Bs or not two Bs. Yeah. So it's it's pretty much we've been back to full strength on the schedule for the better part of nine months. Actually, a little bit more than that. 
Um, but we have offered like an incentive to let people. Oh, we got the beehive. We got five bucks. All right, we'll take that five bucks. Be nice if we can get more than one. Now we're catching up on wins. I think we're up to about eleven dollars now. I don't know if it's me or that cat looks really angry. It's like angry cat. All right, take number thirty-one. Little chicken dog head. Today is the the day that I recorded the video for the new tickets. Um, so probably when I drop this, it'll be a week afterwards. I usually like to spread these things out. Alright, seems like we're in a dead patch again. Our last win was on ticket 29. And Cicada update. Um, they have quieted down. But uh, I still see a lot of dead ones. Um, ones flying around with no butts. Apparently, there is a bacteria or some kind of infection that they get. That uh, it's in the ground when they hatch. So as they're emerging, the bacteria attaches to them. And then it starts to basically infect them. And then they infect each other. Um, and, uh, yeah, they're flying around with no butts. Um, so when they're mating, they're giving each other this cicada STD, <laughs> I'll call it. And, um, yeah, so I started noticing cicadas with no butts and that was when I, uh, mentioned it to the wife and she saw some, she had seen something. We got a bee, we got two bees. She had saw something that said something about an infection that they get, so. Yeah, the noise has subsided, but um, still seeing them in volumes. I still have not gotten in the pool yet. So it's basically just a pretty pond that I have been maintaining. So that is where we're at in 2021. Had I known the cicadas would have been like this, I wouldn't even bother opening the pool until June or July. All right. We'll uh, do a couple more tickets and then we'll do a quick count to see where we're at. My Jedi math is telling me we're somewhere around 18, give or take, in winnings. So, yep. If anyone has learned anything about how many wins or how many losses you can get between these tickets. Now you know that cicadas have STDs. <laughs> so, some little bit of useless information for everyone. All right, let's do a quick count. All right, so we have two, four, six, eight, 10, 15, 16, 18, 19, 20, 21. Okay, that wasn't too far off. 21. All right, we're expecting somewhere in the ballpark of, eh, I've seen most of the dollar books I've done, I've gotten somewhere between 56 and 64. Those seem to be the magic numbers that I obtained. I think my best so far was like 70 something. I think that was on the Washington book. That currency themed set of tickets they had out in 2019 or 2020 rather. Right, go a little closer. I'll make sure I don't miss any. Just looking for the B symbols. All right, ticket number 55. Let's keep our last win on top. So the last one was on 49. So. You go quite a few tickets on this. Uh, I'm gonna be a ticket. You go quite a few tickets between wins and losses. Highest win so far has been five dollars. Although I do remember from the top six prizes, 
Um, there were a lot of $20 prizes, so I would imagine almost every book probably has a $20 win in it. I would imagine we'd probably find one that has a whole bunch of beehives on it. Let's see, for curiosity's sake. Oh, there's a hundo. Uh, 5,000, okay. I just wanted to see what kind of stuff was under there. Dog head, cat, moon. Uh, we're at 10 minutes and well past half the tickets. This was a quick scratch and I already revealed it. Free ticket. All right. I was kind of happy that one game they came out with that they didn't have the free tickets. I think it was, uh, we got a beehive. I think it was the one where, it was, I forget what it was called. It was um, something where you could win like $20. Um, like I think it's called Loaded with 20s. Should have called it Loaded with Crap. I think all I did was find $20 once in that that whole book. I was not impressed. I was uh, talking with uh, somebody today and it's been a observation in Pennsylvania that Pennsylvania tickets, like the games are dying out much quicker than they have in the past. Uh, I can definitely attest to that. I feel like some of the games, I feel like their average life is anywhere between three and six months in most of the 2020 games and even the ones that came out in 2021. Actually, 2020. Yeah, 2020 games and most of the ones in 2021. Like some of them are just gone before I even realize it. I think one of them was... Uh, the Valentine's Day ticket, like that came and went quicker than most relationships. <laughs> and then um, I think uh, the St. Patrick's Day theme ticket, like that one, I, that one was really gone. I don't even think that one lasted four months. I think I, I, I think I did a solo book and we may have done one as a group book. I don't know. Ticket was here and gone so fast, I can't even remember. On well, ticket 74, we have a B. Another free ticket. Yeah, so far I'm not impressed with this one. A lot of free tickets and $1 hits. We got two beehives so far, that's about it. I'm used to seeing at least one $20 hit, maybe a couple of tens, maybe like one ten. A couple five, so unless this little book is backloaded, and oh, there's a beehive, another beehive. Okay, it looks like we talked our ten dollar went up. All right. I think that puts us maybe in the mid thirty range, maybe closer to forty. All right, be nice to hit a twenty. We'll see. Sound off down below in the comments if you're uh, taking a trip somewhere this year. Where you think you're heading? Are you driving? Are you flying? My wife is still recovering from surgery, so there won't be any traveling for us. She hasn't been out of the house now in about a week, week and a half. So by the time I post this video, we would have gone to her first post-op appointment. All right, got another five bucks. Doesn't seem like they're gonna give us that, uh, that one $20 hit, as I was hoping. Yep, so, yep, no trips this year, but I'm still trying to work out a time to go see my son in Tennessee his new house. Like I never really realized the feeling of accomplishment as a parent as, uh, as I did when my son had told me he had uh, purchased his house. So, you know, I was a 
I would say a little worried. I mean, I, once he came up with the plan to get into the military, I, I was okay. I figured he'd be all right, but I didn't know what he was going to do once he got in there. So, yeah, he's been sticking to his plan, and it's working out. So, I'm not complaining. All right. When home stretch, we're on ticket 93. All right, got a B symbol. All right, $2. Seemed like this book was kind of middle and back loaded. I feel like my last $1 book didn't give up any $20 wins either. And this one seems to be following suit, unless it's going to surprise me in the last couple of tickets. Okay, did I lose a ticket or did I do something out of order? Yep, I did. I think I did ticket 99 <laughs> a couple minutes ago. All right, we'll end it with 98. I think it just got lost in the shuffle. All right, okay, ticket 98. We got a B and it's a free ticket. All right, okay, let's just do a quick recount. 16 minutes. All right, not bad. So we got one Three, eight, 13, 23, 24, 26, 27, 28, 33, 34, 35, 37, 38, 39, 40, 42, 43, 48, 50, 52, 54, 56. All right, 56. So. We got just about what we figured we would get. So 56 back on 100. So definitely uh average book. All right, guys. Well, thank you for watching. Please play responsibly and have a good one.